Anthony from HatchesNet here, and on Thursday, September 19th, 2024, the Nintendo company representing the Pokemon company sued Powell Creators Pocket Pair, citing patent infringement. The lawsuit was filed in a Tokyo, Japan court, and Nintendo seeks an injunction and compensation, and I think I may know why. So, if you're familiar with uh, gaming at all, which you should be if you're watching this channel, essentially certain mechanics in games can be patented. Uh, Warner Brothers is famously known for patenting the um, Nemesis system, and before them, of course, uh, Namco Bandai or Bandai Namco, uh, they patented a um, a screen system where you could play a mini game, and so like if you duplicate those in your video games, they can see you. So, what is Nintendo slash Pokemon suing Pocket Pair for? And I think I figured it out. Pokeballs. So, if you've played Pal World and you use a Pal Sphere, uh, they are functionally Pokeballs. So, to give you a scenario, let's say you're gonna, gonna catch a Pal and you throw a Pal Sphere. What happens is the Sphere makes contact, bounces off, and then what you see is it shake three times. And the only difference between it and a Pokeball, which does the exact same thing, is that there is a percentage overlay on the Pal Sphere, and of course the Pal Sphere looks different than a Pokeball, but functionally, which is the important part, functionally, it's the same. Now, I was talking to a, a Pokemon friend, and he did bring up a point about a number of RPG mechanics being similar across games, and yeah, that's true. So you, you really can't go after those specifically. Also, the Pals don't evolve, so that's a whole other bag of chips. So... What really else is there other than Pokeballs? Now, Nintendo is fairly litigious, as somebody who worked for them for a number of years, I'm fully aware, and they won't come to a lawsuit unless they think they can win. And it took them eight months from the release of this game to now to decide to do something, which means they really, they, they literally downloaded the game, took it apart, and then tried to figure everything out. And Pokeballs. I, I can't think of anything that else that is particularly unique to Pokemon because, I mean, evolution isn't even unique. Uh, that is something that even Digimon do. So, it has to be Pokeballs, right? So, what is an injunction? Well, that is basically stop all work. Uh, an injunction could be stop selling the game. An injunction could be shut down the servers. It could potentially impact everybody. And because Power is entirely digital, if it gets to it... There's a chance they may just get removed from your inventory and there's nothing you can do about it. And that sucks. So, what is compensation? Well, assuming that the patent has been violated, Nintendo would want to be paid a certain amount, whatever the court decides, uh, based on each game sale. And uh, then, you know, maybe there will be an agreement that uh, Nintendo allows Power World to continue or Power World decides they're going to create a different mechanic for catching pals that doesn't infringe on a patent. So that's yet to be seen. Tell me your thoughts in the comments. Because frankly, can you think of anything else that Nintendo slash Pokemon have patented as a mechanic in a game? I can't. Tell me in the comments your thoughts in this video. Did you like what you saw and how was your experience with it? Thanks for watching and please remember to like and subscribe.